Do you think the street profits should stay together? Because they teased, of course, Montez Ford, you know, breaking away. And, you know, he looks great in his wrestling. And, and nothing against Dawkins either, because Dawkins can go. I think he's very underrated. But do you think it's time for them to make a break, maybe? Uh, I felt like that maybe like two, three years ago. But I really feel like there is still a little meat left on the bone with them as a duo. And you could be doing more. And I thought recently, like, they had a show stealing matchup on an episode of SmackDown with DIY. And the fact that we're getting that, that triple threat ladder match, that's another match. Like we were just talking about Carmelo and, and Andrade. You're telling me this triple threat ladder match for the WWE tag team titles couldn't be on bloodline on uh, bad blood. Like you got the bloodline, which is the hottest act in the company with Tama Tonga and Tonga Loa. You got DIY that always delivers in their big spots and street profits that are always delivering in big matches. Why can't that be on a premium live event? So I think there is still more for them. They still can, you know, get another run with the tag team championships. I think eventually they could have a nice heel run as well. So they, I mean, yeah, there is a point that, yeah, Breaking them up might give them more opportunities, where it's two different individuals that have the opportunity to be elevated. But I still think that they can be a tag team together on WWE television. Yeah, and it's kind of a shame that the WWE has a track record of you, when you have a tag team that one of the guys can't go after a singles title without you breaking the team up. I mean, yeah. you know, we can go all the way back to you know Sean and Marty, you know, and and even beyond that. And I, I just wish sometimes that they could say, you know what, you know, let the guys stay together, let them be friends. You know, one celebrates the other's success, you know, and then if you want to do a turn at some point, all right, fine. But, you know, it would be cool to just have a team stay together for once, you know, and it's resulted in some great feuds over the years, but still, you know, let's keep the profits together, man. Keep those solo cups coming. And there's just been so many decades of history where WWE only pushes one of the guys. They yeah. never push both of them. Yeah, and we've just seen that this year with Ludwig Kaiser and Giovanni Vinci. They were a great tag team that I was saying should be the tag team champions. Agreed. And then you broke them up. Ludwig Kaiser's doing fine. He's being he's got a prominent role on the mid card on Raw, but Giovanni Vinci is dead on arrival. Yeah, and that's a shame. It really is. And I, I loved Imperium. I, I mean, if you watched a lot of the work that those guys did in NXT, phenomenal. Absolutely yes. phenomenal. So I, I I didn't understand why they broke them up either. It didn't make any sense. And then to do what they've done to Vinci has just been a crime, an absolute crime. Agreed, agreed. And Giovanni Vinci is one of the, could be one of the best in-ring performers on the main roster. It's just sad that they just gave him a gimmick that did that didn't work for them. It worked on NXT for me as a fan, as a viewer, but for them, they didn't like that gimmick. And then they gave him back that gimmick when he went over to SmackDown only to have him job out in a total of two minutes in his first two matches since coming back. It's horrendous. Hi, pro wrestling fans. Mark Hope here. I'd really appreciate it if you would take a moment to join the Mark Hope Show family and please click on the subscribe button below. Also, please stick around and check out the incredible sponsor of this video. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you again on the Mark Hoke Show YouTube channel. Hey there, adventure seeker. Ready to unlock incredible hotel deals? Get a free membership and save up to 50%. Stay grand. Spend less. The simplest site. The best unpublished hotel deals. TheTravelShark.com